Hey guys, team put a lot of effort into this, so if you enjoy it, drop a like. What is up dudes? Welcome to our very first PUBG fashion show. We've done other customs, we've done musical chairs, Marco Polo, uh, hide and seek, uh, you know, 5v5 battles, stuff like that. But this is our very first time showing off, you know, players threads in the game. So we have nine contestants coming down. They're going to show us their stuff and they're going to tell us, you know, about their style or about their personnel, what they're going for with that. So first person I'm going to ask, walk down our makeshift runway <laughs> at the observatory <laughs> is going to be dyslexic. Come on down. <clears throat> Come on down. I'm, I'm coming up. Where are you right now, Milta? Oh, there we go. This is... <laughs> Alright, you're doing some push-ups on your way in. I got it. Gotta stay fit. For that pants-free life. Alright. Alright, here we go. Let me just go in first person here. Alright, Dyslexic, welcome. Welcome to the show. So tell us a little bit about what you got going on here. So, uh, I'm cosplaying a 42-year-old uh, uh, white male who is going through a midlife crisis. He uh, sexually identifies as a panda, as you can see on my shirt. Um, he decided to cut his hair because uh, his wife divorced him and his wife had long hair. So, uh, yeah. What he better way to be solve younger. that than like to look like Skrillex? Okay, I got it. What else you got going on here? You got, uh, got some boots on, man. So, like, 15, there's enough straps for you? Yeah, uh, I'm pretty goth. So, uh, also a McCree main, as you can see the magnum on my hip. <laughs> okay. How, how do you have to get in the stick there, man? Got, did you glue it to your thigh? Is it, can you actually take it off without, like, tearing off your skin, or nah? Uh, it's there permanently. Like, uh, don't worry about it. How about your gloves, man? I like the gloves. The spikes? Yeah. What's it with that? It's the goth. That's my, uh, my goth, uh, influence, uh, I like to, um fluid with my sexuality as a panda goth panda sounds solid man all right dude anything else to add or otherwise thank you for uh showing off your your threads yeah no good, good luck with your next bride by the way sorry the first one didn't work out that haircut will show her for sure don't worry man revenge try, man. there we go thank you dyslexic <laughs> i don't know the walk off just got me all right next up ck come on down Stunning. All right. We've got the Gordon's Fisherman walking on down here. Wait, CK, you on the way? Or is this you? Yes. This is me. Oh, this is you. Oh, wow. Look at that, man. You've got... This is an interesting outfit right over here, man. So how about you get started, CK? What, what, what do we have going on here, dude? I mean, the funniest thing you said was that it was an outfit. This isn't an outfit. This is a lifestyle. I what kind of lifestyle, like the lifestyle of scaring away all your loved ones and friends, or what, what do you got going on here? What's, what's lifestyle all about? Don't make me laugh. No, <laughs> don't make me laugh. This is a lifestyle of an assassin. Everything I wear has purpose. It's practical. You see these? You see these fists right here? Okay. Yep. You I've seen the, these before. Right. See this fight? Yeah. You uh, see this yep. fight? Yep. You don't want to be the receiving end of this. I did not want to be on the receiving end of that. I'd be pretty yeah. upset. Yes, yeah, you're, yeah, you're yeah. right. So, uh, I mean, everything. I mean, you can see all the, uh, I mean, the blood stains, there's grass stains on this jacket. I mean, grass stains. I mean, you know, a four year old can get grass stains by just rolling around the playground, dude. I don't know if we're bragging about I that. I mean, but yes, well, that's what I have to do. Look, I start my prayer. Right on, man. Keeping those dry cleaners in business. All right, I got a question for you, though. How come only your, your right knee has a knee pad on it? What happened to your left knee pad? Uh, my, uh, my other knee is quite strong. I mean, you know, and I, when, I, when I'm crouching, you see it only goes on one knee. And then I don't really need it for the other knee, you see? <laughs> okay. All right, two more questions for you, man. So I see okay. you got, like, you know, like a, not a bandana, like a face mask. Made out of mm -hmm. like, is that is that leopard leopard print? Like what's yes, going on there, yes, dude? That is correct. Well, obviously the bandana, it's an identity thing. You'll never and know you who I am. Um, I do I actually don't. But, uh, can you can you like can you clarify who you are? 
no, 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 that is confidential. Um, you'll never. No, no one can know. You just told me I know who you are, and now you're telling me it's confidential. No, no, no. All right. You can never know. You can't. And that's what I'm saying. Like, okay, put away, put away the gun. All right. If, I don't know. I'll if never I tell know. You, I'm gonna have to kill you. Okay. So then that, don't. Then don't tell me. All right. And last thing, your your, your plaid T-shirt over here, dude, reminds me of uh, Al from Home Improvement. You know, like his his, his red shirt. Anyone uh, remember I Al? Am I just, am I just really old? No, it might be just really old. I, no. All right, I you don't know. I've never seen that. But, but look, I mean, it's pretty nice. It's, uh, I just like the style of it, you know? I, everything's practical and it has my inside, you know, personality on the inside. All right. You know? I will give it to you. It looks very unique. All right. Thank you, CK. I'll You're see you, uh, I'll see you at, the, at the finale. So for those of you guys watching, the way we're going to determine our winners is that everyone's going to kind of come down. We've got some more, some more stylish individuals coming down, tell us about their outfit, and then our live audience will, will let us know one by one who should be eliminated. All right, so next up, let's see uh, Dubai. Dubai was lit. Come on down, dude. <clears throat> Any moment now. There he goes. All right. <laughs> You sure you're not sweaty from running up the mountain like that, dude? <laughs> so, uh, I'll be, I'm gonna tell my life story right now, so. All right, let let me hear your. Let me hear. Whoa. whoa. Getting in my story. Hey, just don't worry about it. It's uh, it's going on. So, I got these school shoes when I was little, uh, for going to school. And, okay, and, school uh, shoes for going to school. I didn't know that was a reward, after, man. I feel like I got gypped in my after school days. Preschool, I got some clothes, you know, because you gotta you gotta have those. It's oh, usually wait, nice uh, to have when you go to school. Sure. Yeah. This. I grew up in a western town, so you got this uh, jeans and a checkered shirt. Right got here. got the Nathan Drake thing going on. All right. All right. Yeah. And then uh, in college, I uh, decided to work at a chicken shop, so I got this hat from the chicken shop. As you can see, it says chicken, chicken right there. But so it's like the, you know, you ever see, you ever watch Naruto where they have like their their village like symbols on their head, but like when they've like you know been like you know excommunicated from the village there's like there's a cross to it you've got like a cross to your chicken are you, have you were you were you fired from your chicken job uh were, were they kick you, you out did they ban you from the I chicken society all right it's fine man i'm not, try, I'm not trying to break and you know bring out any yeah. feelings sure yeah it was it was pretty hard for me to lose that job so. by the way you're stepping on your jacket yeah, man oh yeah you're all right that looks like it's a nice jacket that well, is worth like a little bit because these shoes are from a long time ago when i was in school and i want to keep them like Nice and clean, you know. So, so do you, uh, do you just kind of like have like two shirts? You just kind of like put one down, walk on it, put down another one. Like, how do you keep them clean? Yeah, I do that sometimes. Sometimes I like in this backpack, I got basically like a red carpet, and then I just lay it down, walk across it, and then pick it back up. But it's so, not red. Uh, after I lost, but my, it's all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah sorry. My, my try, sorry, sorry, sorry. So you lost, you lost your what? What'd you lose? Oh, I didn't lose anything. I don't know where that. You let from. yeah. All right. Okay. Well, you have you have everything you've ever had. Lost my job. Lost your job. So after you I did lost lose my job, job all right. I decided yep. I'm gonna I'm gonna join this thing where I'm gonna become a superhero. You know what I'm saying? So I got this cape right here. It's a it's a nice brown cape. It's got some padding on it. Basically, I like it, man. Uh, my grandfather gave me a revolver, and then I just went at it and killed all the bad boys. And then uh, all the bad yeah. boys. All there you go, man. I like that. It's got the yeah, Mad Max got, deal to that, but you can always take off the jacket and bam, you're ready to like, like go on some adventures and swing through some mountains. Yeah. Like, All right. This backpack, you don't even know what, what I have in here. In store. I don't know. I didn't like, look inside. I don't know what's inside that backpack. You're right. Yeah, it's confidential. Okay. We'll keep it that way. Dubai, thank you very much, dude. We'll see you at the uh, at the finale. All right. All right. I'll see you. Stay, stay out of trouble there. You watch out for those bad boys. All right. <laughs> All right. Next up, let's take JTAP. Come on down. What up? What up, JTAP? Let's get like, let's get that, you know, that that supermodel, that walk, man. Come on down. Take your time. Uh, okay, okay. You're in control. Got the back. Side, All right. Front. All you need. All right. There you we go. You know what okay. they say? You are what you wear, Swift. I'm just going to get right to the point. Very, very true, man. Yeah. Oh, dude, I, I like Grove that. Street, LA. You know? Grove Street, LA. Right. right. I'll let you compliment me real quick. What'd you, what'd you say? What'd you say? All right, I'm just checking. I'm just, check, I'm just checking story. out your your outfit, man. Okay. This is this is okay. unique. I like it. I got all the finest clothes that the world has to offer, and I'm bringing right. back Velcro, something you won't see often. Dude, you know, get, I like when, being unique. 
absolutely, man. When you're adventuring, right? Who got who has time to sh- tie their shoes, right? You gotta like s- velcro it and go. We got better things to do, right? Exactly, exactly. That's what I was thinking when I was making this outfit. And of course, as you see, I've got some spiky gloves in case I needed to defend myself from the bears of the Alaskan wilderness. Do you think? Do you really think those are actually effective against bears? Like, like, look at your fist. Are those actually gonna be effective against a bear? Have you have you yeah. ever actually encountered a bear? Have you ever seen one of those YouTube videos um, where like well, bears attack um, things? I don't just anyway. Yeah, but I'm a whole food for thought. Sort of human, all right. I'm sure, a different okay. human. And, uh, all right. Built different. I'm rocking built everything differently. that the world has to offer, and. These glasses, obviously, they're my favorite part. Squared. We're bringing they Squared are, back. We're all about like the 90s and the early 2000s. You don't see this often. Everyone's wearing all their fancy clothes, all that. I got Velcro, boxy glasses. I got just everything that you need. I got a question for you, man. You said we. Who, who, who's we? Do you have like an imagine? Is there, is there someone else around here that I should be aware of? Like who's, who's bringing back these boxy glasses with you? Is someone hiding back over here? Who we it's got? It's just my gang. You know, Your gang. I can't really say any names here. I'm not a snitch. All right, that, all right man. They were keep, you know, keep that. I hear you. Keep them uh, confidential. I hear that. Yep. Dude, looking good, man. Dude, I will say, very sharp. This Thank is this is JTAP, everyone. All right. Like yep. what you got, and I'll see you at the end, man. Thank you very Thank much, you. dude. That was good. That was good. I like that outfit. That was good. It was clean. Velcro shoes. Kind of a questionable choice, but you know what? When it goes for efficiency, I, I believe what I said there. You put them on, you strap them, and you go. All right. Next up. <laughs> All right. We have our only only female contestant. Meg, come on down. All right. Got that Jennifer Lawrence walk over there. Oh, she had it. Now she lost it. No, you guys are in no rush. You guys take your time. Oh, we got some back problem. Maybe is there something wrong? Is, is you know nothing wrong with that? You know, like <laughs> you need to get you need to get that looked at. Like swag walk, you know, like it? swag walk. Your swag walk. Okay, there we go. Okay, got it. Got it. It was a swag walk. Definitely not back issues. Got it. So, so Meg, tell us about what we got going on over here. So, my outfit starts from my rebellious teenage years. As you can see, my hair is dyed red. I wear a baseball cap because I don't like the sun. I hate being outside. The shirt, mm, well, didn't really have a choice. My dad made it. And the, 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 the trousers, I stole them from some locker in school. And the shoes, they look quite expensive, but I'm pretty sure they were from my nan's house. Uh, so, the gloves. I, yep. Gloves, again, rebellious punk rock emo style gotta say anyone comes near me they aren't gonna have a fun time <laughs> because of the gloves right not because of anything else yeah because of the gloves because of the gloves just clarify poke some eyes out some eyes out will get that's a lot out. of eyes you can do with those gloves that's like eight <laughs> eyes at a time you're just like out there like poke 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 nah, it's so a question it's, it's two spikes per eye that's usually how it works for for most <laughs> folks yeah yeah so so here's my question for you you said your dad makes you wear that shirt is it, is it, like, sewn into your skin? Can you just not take it he, off? Did your dad, like, make... drug you and just, like, ah, <laughs> like, you're never taking off this shirt now? No, like, no, what's no. The, what... He didn't make me wear it. He didn't make me wear it. It's just, during my rebellious teenage years, I demanded money for, like, new outfits. And, obviously, we struggled with, like, money and stuff. So, he thought he'd make me this shirt. And, I don't know, I kind of grew to love it. Got it. So, you said you're rebellious to... First. So your rebellious teenage years are over. So what years are you in right now? Are they just your, uh, you know, uh, like, are they like the adventurous I'd say teenage early years? Adult, early adult years, but again, you know, everyone has their misadventures. Not so right, I've right. Been involved if, in a few crimes. If they're lucky, just one second. Let me see. What, what is your, what does your, your hat stand for? What's the S for on your the hat? S. Yeah. Um, uh, it, doesn't, it doesn't have to stand for anything. It just be an S. S because it's cool. It, it, it stands for something, but I'm not sure. If oh, it's stands, oh, uh, the S say. stands for something. That's a pretty good word. The S for something. <laughs> no, not not like something. That. It's just I can't tell you. It's you gotta make up your mind. Does S stand? What does S stand for? Does it stand for something? It, it, against the law. It's against the law. Against the law. All right, guy. I'm not. I'm not here to break the law. Clearly, so. So that's cool. But yeah, I like the outfits. Clean the shirt. You know, I got that. I like that quilt on the on the on the left. Just left, need left, deny left it, though, don't you agree? No, I'm being unbiased right now. It's up to me. I'm just here to <laughs> show people off, so I'm not going to take any sides. I mean, that was a nice try, but I'm just, I'm just 
taking it all in. You know what I mean? So, Meg, yeah. thank you very yeah. much for, for showing off your outfit, and I hope that your, your early adult years are, are fruitful and, and, and fashionful. Yeah. Never gonna happen. Yeah, that's the only a word. And, yeah, you know, good luck with the health insurance thing. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Next up, let's go ahead and take uh, Toastbuster. Come on down. Any moment now. There we go. Oh, I saw someone. Now, now that I see him again. There we go. Disappeared for a moment. But now they're back. Now I see they're back. All right. All right, he's finding some imaginary people around him. Maybe he's, maybe he's on something. Hello, Toastbuster. How, you, <laughs> are, you, how, are, you, how are you doing today, man? Good thing I you mean, took care of those dudes that were bothering us. Way to go. Appreciate your help there. I think yeah, they're all gone now. No problem. No problem. Yeah, I just want to tell you. Come here. Come here. Come here. Shh. All right, I'm here. So, yeah, so, so, yeah. This, so this outfit? You want to know how yep. I got it? Yep. I'm a designer, bro. I'm not cosplayer, bro. I'm Toastbuster, dude. You see all these people wearing these gloves right here? See them? Like, I don't know for me, bro. These boots. My whole outfit, dude. I made it, dude. You see this? Watch so this. Qu all right. This? I'm, a I'm a ninja, bro. And so, question. Dude. Question. Are you very, like, targeted designer? Are there only certain things that you design? Because it looks like you didn't design yourself a shirt. I figured that was, like, a pretty basic thing that, that people just do. Like, they, they bro, come on. the shirt's, like, the first thing you design. You don't seem to have a shirt on right now, so I'm, I'm a little concerned about your the direction you've taken as a designer. Who needs a shirt, dude? Everyone can make a shirt. No one can be okay. a designer like me. I mean, I'm, I'm, I mean if, if you say so. Here, look. Oh, yeah, okay. Go, oh, go ahead, man. Tell me. Take that. Wear it. Put it on. No? no? All right. All right. <laughs> I'll, I'll put, no, no. I'll, I'll put it on, man. I can. I can. Let's take, let's take a look here. I'm wearing my merch. There we go. Uh, wait. Did, dude. That is not cool, man. You can't just give me something and put it on and be like, I'm endorsing your, your, your line of products. You know, I'm going to have to give this back to you, dude. Hang on. Oh, okay. That's cool. Hang on. Hang on. Wait, wait. We're... Oh, sorry. Can you put it back uh, in the floor? Can you put it back in the floor for a second? Oh. Sorry. Oh, that's why I think oh. of your merch, man. Don't try and, oh, don't try and wrangle me to be your to shill for you, man. bro. Whoa. You All right, man. I'm start my own brand. How'd you do it? Drugs? Murder? No, man. I mean, my mom's credit card. <laughs> <laughs> yep. All right. All right. Cool, man. I hope, I hope she, um, that's very nice for her to give you full permission to, to use your credit card for all this, this reaching your dream. That's very, permission. very kind of her. What permission? Yeah. All right, to toast. Any anything else you want to add, man? Uh, uh no thanks. I'm All good. right, thank you very much. You can take your glasses, and uh, I'll see you perhaps kind of at, the, at the end of the show. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Let for that guy from getting back up. There we go. So don't fall off the mountain. Thanks. All right. Uh, <laughs> Next up, we have we have three more contestants. Where Joe? Come on down. The awkward moment where where people are not actually ready to walk. There we go. Whoa, where, where'd you? Where'd you? Hang on, hang on, hang yeah. on. Yeah, don't worry, don't worry. School's, school's not in session yet. Don't worry. You won't be late to class. So what, what do you got going? What question? Have you have you seen my daughter anywhere? She's like three, four, wearing a pink shirt. No, I don't. I don't. I don't really keep track of young kids. Sorry. Okay. Okay. You have somewhere else you need to be right now? Are you like? Are you occupied? Do you have time for us right now? Uh, well, I, I just recently brought my daughter to a, a Justin Bieber concert, and uh, I went to go get a um, pair of sick knuckle gloves at the concession they had there. You see these bad you, you're, boys? You're in them right now? Sweet. Yeah. Yeah. Let's stop talking about the, yeah. the daughter. Let's stop talking about the daughter you're missing. Your, your beloved okay. daughter. Let's talk about your gloves. Yeah. Sure, I'm done. Yeah. Four ninety nine. Four ninety nine dollars, yeah. or is four dollars ninety nine cents? Four dollars ninety nine cents. Each glove or for both? Uh, each glove, each glove. All right, that's 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 not bad. That's not bad. Yeah. All right. So, uh, gotta have my blue high top trainers, cause gotta stay hip like all the kids. Yeah, but about your daughter, are you you concerned at all, man? I mean, should we really be talking about your 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 clothes uh, when like your daughter's been missing? She's three, four years old at a Justin Bieber concert. I, mean, I, I have a box of crayons, so she'll probably come back for that. So, uh, sir. 
She'll come back eventually. These, these are these, these are these, these are these are bullets. These aren't crayons. You can you can hurt people with these oh. when they're when they're in guns. Oh, she's what else? What else? What, what else? What else did you so. give? What else did you give your daughter? Uh, I think she has like a gasoline can or something. You didn't tell her it was like Hawaiian Punch or anything, right? Where, Joe? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Uh, she just she just has a thing for gasoline. She loves fueling cars and stuff. Fueling cars. You you training her to like to really for a bright future, huh? Yeah. That gas station work. Wow, man, you really love your family. Yeah. All right. Automotive. Well, tell me, yeah. T- tell me more about your outfit, dude. Uh, I got my backpack to carry all the Justin Bieber merch in. You know. Okay. Dude, are you sure you were, you, were nice. you taking your daughter to this Justin Bieber concert or was she just with you when you went? Okay, um, I have this dad hat right here. What does the S stand for on your hat? This dad hat. Um, Red Sox. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> and All the, right. if you look on the back, closely on the back, it says the genius style, which I had printed on that for ten ninety nine. Can you believe that? What, what a price. It says the, the genius ge- style, 1976. That's, that's pretty genius to put on the back of the hat. I like, I like that plan. All right, yeah, where, yeah, yeah. All right, where, Joe, anything else you want to add, dude, or you want to go back to looking for your um, daughter? Or whatever, or, uh, yeah, look, or Justin Bieber, MP3s. Okay. All right, man, thanks Maybe for joining in. Good luck with your concert. daughter. Make sure she didn't drink that gasoline. All right. Thank you, Where, Joe. That was Where, Joe. All right. We got two more contestants. Uh, Yaya, come on down. Uh oh. Sir, sir, you lost. I, I, I can't sir, find my sir, way. Sir, 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 you you Hello? lost. I'm, hi. Are, are you from here? I mean, no, I'm not from here. I mean, like, I'm here right now, though. I can't find my friends. Did you they, have they any friends or are you looking? Okay. I do have so. some friends. Oh, great. But you know what? While you're here, I noticed you've got like, you know, an interesting outfit going on. You want to tell us a yeah, little bit about it? Made, yeah, I lost a bet and they made me wear this outfit. And so, I had to pay for this outfit too from my wait, own money. Can you imagine? So you, so you lo- what kind of bet did you lose that they made you pay for an outfit? We were playing Monopoly. Okay. And and you lost the Monopoly game, and they're like, ha-ha. Like, you lost the bet, now you got to go shopping and yeah. buy all the stuff I point out, and then you got to wear it. So you're wearing a helmet, yeah. this this coat. Each one of them, yeah. Basically, each item I wear, each one yep. of them just... Whoa, 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 you're taking it off? Dude, what's the bet like? Do you have to wear it for the rest of your life, or what's the... Yeah, don't worry, I won't tell them For that. a don't whole worry. day. For a whole day, okay, I won't tell them you took it off, don't worry. Okay, we good. So secret, so, our so, secret. Don't tell anyone. So yeah, yeah. I mean, would you make that bet again? Uh, uh, downtown, in a coffee shop. All right, that's what I asked, but I'll take it. So, so now, even though they made you wear this, you want to tell us about your outfit? Like, what do you think of you? What you're wearing? I think it's ridiculous. Who's wearing a a motorcycle hat or? A, <laughs> helmet on a vest like this sure I, they I made me work <laughs> they made you know, they, me they, wear a, a vest a police vest can you imagine they bought me I'm, a, no they if, they, if they look if they made you wear a helmet and they made you wear a police vest you know what that tells me it what? tells me they they cared about you they cared about your safety look the guy that made you wear this 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 thick ass coat they they care about you being warm they, they got you that, that you see they they were concerned about you but all right yeah, yeah i mean maybe it's time to go look for those friends yeah. and maybe yeah. i'll see you later okay all right i'll see you real soon yep yep they're not they're not around here no, your friends aren't here thanks yeah. all right <laughs> all right and last but not least cheese monkey come on down that was yeah yeah guys <laughs> Where are you guys coming? From? There we go. Yeah, you're in the right place. Hey, cheese monkey. You guys ever watch like a fashion show before? People, they walk very slowly towards the end of the walk. Run. No, they don't walk into walls. Where am I going? 
Where am I going? I can't tell where to go. Look, just don't don't walk off the mountain, bro. It's gonna. <laughs> where sir, sir, am sir, I sir. Going? Listen to my listen to my voice. Listen, yeah, right here. Yeah, yeah. Follow my voice. You're you're good. You're right where you are. All right. She's Sorry, monkey. they left me with they left me without my walking cane. I am blind. All right, that's cool. I'll, all right, thank you, Cheese Monkey. I'm, gla I'm glad you made it here in one. Yeah, go ahead. All right, well, Cheese Monkey, I'm glad you made it and you didn't hurt yourself too much walking into that wall and walking off the mountain. So, so I mean, I know you can't see how you look, but how do you think you look right now? Want to tell us a little bit about how you think you look? The clothes you think you put on today? I feel like I look fine. It's a okay. little drafty up here, though. I mean, you have no sleeves. Do you, are you aware you have no sleeves on, like on your on your shirt? I thought I put a shirt with sleeves on today. You know, we all make mistakes. It's fine, man. I mean, with all the challenges in life, you know, if that's all you got wrong, you're good. So, what why else? did my what? friends leave me with a, without a helmet? I I could have fallen off the they mountain. Don't, they don't care about you as much as they cared about that last guy. But I see you've got you got some goggles on. I mean, if you can't see, why why have anything on your eyes? Your eyes look made of glass, or what's going on? It's to protect me, because to show people that I am blind so they don't run into me. Okay. Got it. I mean, it's good to know. Your, your pants look a little bit on, on the dirty side, man. Like, you paint, you were painting your room red or something? Or, like, what's been going on? I see specks of red all over your, your white jeans. I had to kill my competition so that I could stay afloat. Uh, wow, that's pretty morbid, man. So, uh, any, <laughs> anything else that you want to tell us about your outfit here, dude? I made this outfit all by myself. That's pretty impressive considering you have this, this sight disability, dude. you have any other talents that we're not aware of? No. That's your only talent. You can make clothes while being blind. All right, you did a pretty good job considering, I mean... It could have been a lot worse. So, Cheese Monkey, thank you very much, man. Do you need any help guiding yourself back to uh, backstage? Yes. Yes. Well, I, well, there's no help here, so just go. Good luck. <laughs> All right. There we go. So, we have that. Those are our nine contestants. Now, uh, each one has their own angle and their own. Wonderful uh, story to tell. So, we're going to bring them all back down. So, could I, could I please have all of you guys come back down and, and line up for me shoulder to shoulder, please? Oh, wow. What the hell? <laughs> all right. Do it in order. I'll go. I mean, whatever order is fine. We're going we're gonna to just go over names again real quick. And we're going to start the process of, of elimination. So... Here we go. So, we got, uh, hang on. Let me see if I remember who's who here. Uh, is this uh, Toastbuster I'm looking at? Yeah, it is. Yes, there we go. Got Toastbuster over here. You have Meg over here. Hi, Meg. Yep. Over here we have uh, J Tap, right? Yep. All right, over here we have uh, Where Joe. Yep. Any luck finding your kid, by the way? Uh, no luck. All right, unfortunate. Um, <laughs> next up, we got we got uh, Yaya, right? Yes, me. All right. Then we also got uh, Dubai. No, wait. Dubai. Yeah, it's Dubai. Yeah. All right. There we go. All right. All right. Excellent. All right. It's almost like a little quiz for myself. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> all right. We got we got CK over here. Yes, you do. <laughs> can, I, can I help the blind man to a we spot? Got, we have dyslexic and sir, sir, my sir, cheese monkey. Follow my yes. voice. Follow my voice. Follow my voice. Over here. Over here. Warmth. There we go. I'm glad I didn't scrape your entire face off on that sign over there. I don't. I don't. I'm only renting this place. I don't want to pay. Don't want to lose my deposit. All right. Great. So, so guys, you guys all did great. I can really appreciate all your fashion sense. Sort of, kind of. But we're going to start eliminating players one at a time. So, so folks in chat, who who do you think 
of all these very stylish people was the least very stylish? Let me know in chat now. I don't want to hear who, you, who your favorite was. We're trying to go reverse order here. Least favorite. Let's go. Throw some names down. Uh, okay, oh, I think I, I think I think I think, I think we got our first. Think we got think we got our first. All right. So the plus side here is this is not your fault. You know who you should blame? Your friends. My friends. But also you did lose a game of Monopoly, so it's kinda of your fault. It's kinda of anti anticlimactic when it takes more it's than two shots. Man. You know, thanks to your friends though, you were able to take more than more than one shot. So yeah, yeah congratulations on, on being the first to go. Alright. So who should be the second to go? What do you think is next? Please Who's next? I sexually identify as a panda. Well, I'm not calling you by your sexual identification, bro. Let's be let's be straight here. But my okay. Are such. All right, got it. All right, so our, our next player to go, Meg. Meg! <laughs> hey, you didn't die. You didn't die. Jump off the next one. <laughs> Target pre All right, she's she's gone. All right, rest <laughs> in peace, Meg. Okay, there we go. All right, we only have have seven players left. All right, next up. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> what, dude? All right, all right. Now I think the reason here is that perhaps like you didn't have, <laughs> you didn't have the shirt making in, on your resume, man. <laughs> Look, you, <laughs> you can make the shirt. Oh. <laughs> he survived. No, watch. Hey, blind man, follow my, my voice. All right, there we go. Toast is out. Okay. Hey, hey. All right, there we go. There we go. Blind guy's back. Six players left. I think I think I see we got them. All right. All right. Excuse me, cheese monkey, sir, sir. I think I think I found which which way you need to go. <laughs> Just. Follow my voice there. Just get... Yep, yep. You're right. Your friends are right down there. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. Okay. All right. Cheese Monkey is, 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 has went somewhere where, he, where you can finally see where he's going. All right. <clears throat> Plenty of light down there. Okay. Next up, who's, who's the next to go, guys? Who's the next to go? <laughs> All right, CK. I'm very sorry, man. But the person next to you has to die. Drop it. All right. All right. Dyslexic is out. Some cruel people here. Some cruel people. All right. I think we got. Kill me. Me I'm assassinate you all in my death. All right. So the plus side is that. It's hard to assassinate when you're dead. Ooh. But CK, thank you very much for your stylish encounter. Whoa, 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 buddy. Whoa, buddy. Whoa, buddy. No, there's none of that here. There's none of that here. None of that here. All right, remaining players are JTAP, Where Joe, and Dubai. These are the top three. Who's <laughs> who's, the next, who's the next to go? <laughs> I think I got it. All right. All right. So, so Where Joe. Folks, just we're not a fan. I, I think you know what, what hit it for them. I think it's the fact that that you chose to be here instead of finding your daughter, and that you fed her gasoline. We'll At talk about that in a little bit. Breath. Oh. 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 Run Dubai. Be free. Be free. I live <laughs> today to see another Justin Bieber concert. I mean, I let my daughter see another Justin Bieber concert. Another day? You think you're living another day? All right, guys, this is it. Maybe a second. Who? We're gonna keep on with the theme of 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 elimination here to keep it real simple. Who should go? Is it gonna be J Tap or Where Joe? Who's Where Ho? <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. This is tough. This is tough. But I think we have our winner. All right, congratulations, Where Joe. Oh, I'm Get the next going. bullet. Ooh. There we go. All right. Congratulations, JTAP. Let's see Thank what we you. got here. Let's, let me find my prize. 
What prizes do we have? Any prizes at all? I don't the think most so. Expensive shirt in the game and a TV shirt. Pick up my coat. Body. You know, yeah. I mean, uh, you guys had some pretty sure expensive I'll outfits. Let me get one. One piece from every person. Grab, the, grab the leopard pin, mask, the of course. There grab we go, the man. You, you, your, your, pr your prize is to take all these expensive outfits. But yeah, who I had the most? Who, oh, nice. who had the most expensive outfit overall? Like total cost. I was told CK had like CK. a really expensive outfit. CK. My shirt itself is eight hundred. Yeah, CK. I mean, the bandana is pretty expensive too. The, the sh <laughs> is that is that coat ex is, is that coat expensive. expensive too, or like is that expensive coat, or you just like Which it? One? Nah, uh, the white coat. Oh, the white? Uh, the mask is the most expensive. How much does the mask go for? 200. I sold it the other day. TBH. Oh, nice. Nice. All right, JTAP, any, any words, man? Any style advice for everyone watching at home? Be yourself. Uh, wear what you love. And uh, love yourself, of course. You know, love yourself. The there we go. the most important part. Absolutely. Well, I got to be going now. Time for my next gig. Bye, Swift. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I broke my leg. I'll be hang on. Lumping to the edge. <laughs> and there we go. Alright, good job guys. A lot of fun. If you want to join in for our next uh next PUBG fashion extravaganza, we'll probably wait until there's a new drop of like you know, new clothes or whatever like that. But also just make sure you you follow Swift Alert, you watch out for the heads up that we're doing this and uh come by the live show and enter in. Uh, I want to thank all the con contestants for, for being so cooperative and coming up with the great stuff. Had a lot of fun. Loved it. There was no, no duds there. It was great. And uh, if you enjoyed the video, press like. Maybe share it with somebody or community or whatever. Thanks for watching, guys. Great game. See you next time. Dudes, as always, thank you for watching my videos. It really means a lot. I also want to share with you guys that I'm now officially sponsored by Soylent. I drink at least two bottles a day. Just a meal in a bottle. Tastes good. Um, chocolate's my favorite flavor, coffee, original, close second. Links in the description if you want to check it out, make me look good. And really, I think you're going to love it. Chocolate all day, baby. Thanks for watching, dudes.